it always bothers me when I, I get onto a plane, taxi out, up in the sky, I'm looking around me and everybody's reading magazines, newspapers, watching movies. Have they got any idea how much CO2 is being generated? And there's a really simple sum you can do. If you say flying from London to Sydney, that's about 20 hours of flying. And 20 hours on a plane which is consuming fuel at what kind of rate? Um, four kilograms per second, you can check that on the internet. That's for a, a plane like a, a jumbo jet or a Airbus, that's the fuel. And there's uh, 350 passengers, say. And when you've got the fuel rate, hours, passengers, you can work out how much fuel is your own responsibility. The other thing you have to do is to multiply by three to get from fuel to carbon dioxide because one kilogram of fuel produces three kilograms of carbon dioxide. That's that thing that fuel is mostly carbon, but CO2 is carbon with mixed with this heavy oxygen molecule. If you do the sums, you've got uh, four kilograms per second uh, and three kilograms of CO2 per kilogram of fuel. Uh, 20 hours, but you've got to multiply by 3,600 to get seconds. Um, and then per passenger, you divide by 350. And then I like to think how many 20 kilogram suitcases of CO2 would this be? Because this will give me, give me the total number of kilograms, but if I divide by 20 as well, that gives me... Uh, about 125 suitcases. And I've run out of space on my page. So I have a suitcase which weighs about 20 kilograms and it's got CO2 in it. I know how much a 20 kilogram suitcase feels like. I've got 125 of these to pick up on the carousel in Sydney. And what if it was my duty to dispose of those 125 20 kilogram suitcases? What if it was my duty to do that before I went to the hotel, before I go to see my friends and family? In exactly the same way, it's, it's, it's my duty to flush the toilet before I leave the bathroom. I mean, we, we think of how we dispose of waste in so many ways but we don't think about how we dispose of this waste. 125 20 kilogram suitcases of waste. Well, I don't generate 20 kilograms worth of kitchen waste in a week. And yet this is 125 times more than, I, than my household waste. And I don't even think about it. How are you gonna get the message across that flying is one of the worst things you can be doing. The thing that I feel about flying is that I've been hoodwinked. I've been duped into thinking that flying, perfectly safe, it's perfect, it's, it's clean. It's, it's the best way to get around. It's, see the world. It doesn't, there's, there's no penalty. Everyone should do it. And I think 30, 40 years ago when the jumbo jet transformed the way we fly, really. We ought to have been told, by the way, by the time you get to your destination, you've got 125, 20 kilogram suitcases to get rid of. Mm -hmm.